got my my green screen and my tripod. I have this shit like propped up on my counter. I finally moved. I just forgot things at my mom's place. So the next video, I'll have those things, just not for this one. We're gonna talk about the horrors of dieting. So once you get to like 6% and below, shit starts to get fucking crazy for you. Well, once you're at that level, your calories are pretty low. Mm, getting from 6% to 3% is the killer part. Your body really just really fights you to fucking get there. Right now I'm sitting at, I'd say like 5%. And the last 2% that I'm trying to lose is just really, really destroying me. So you can be like normal, just chill, just like, huh, well I wanna watch this show that I, I haven't watched. And then you'll just have like an intense bout of rage. You'd be like, I wanna fucking kill everyone. And then you'll be normal again. You'll be like, haha, life is good, life is great, haha. That happens pretty often. You get some crazy mood swings. I don't really get anxiety, I know some people do. Mine is more just like rage and not anger. Just like pure, pure rage for no reason. A good, a good example is like I'll be driving and usually like, you know, 10% body fat. I'm happy, I'm driving and some stupid motherfucker in Houston is like doing stupid shit and I'll be like, look at this fucking idiot, fuck this guy or girl. But here, 5%, I'll be like, I wish this motherfucker would pull over so I could fuck him up. That's not me, that's the diet. Do you get crazy mood swings? There's a lot of times where I get really dizzy. Really dizzy and like on the verge of passing out. Everything, everything you do really tires you out. So, say I'll, I, like, I work a lot on the computer, I'm pretty much always on the computer. Uh, oftentimes, especially like the last two days, cause I've, in case you're wondering, I'm at 1800 calories. I'm usually maintenance three, three to three to 3,500 calories, so I can't even talk right. Uh, I'll be on the computer, you know, just sitting there doing shit. And then I'll just be like, oh, fuck. Like I'll be mentally fatigued just from doing shit on the computer. I'll be mentally fatigued. I literally have to look away from the screen and just be like, oh, fuck. Just kind of like close my eyes and just kind of like rest a little because I'm so tired all the time. That happens pretty often. Really the only time I have a good amount of energy is when I'm training because I kind of just save all my energy that I have during the day. That's pretty lean, right? I, I conserve my energy just to train. And I, I try to maintain a high level of intensity while training because I'm still trying to get leaner. And the only way to do that is to fucking work hard for it, right? Uh, I'll take I'll take a bunch of naps. Right now I'm probably at like four naps during the day. Usually after meals and after training, I'll take a nap. 15, 20 minutes. I don't it's just weird. So some like sometimes I'll eat and so I'll feel fine I'll feel fine before. Like I'm tired, I'm fatigued, but I'll eat and then when I'm eating I'm like, yes. Everything tastes amazing by the way. I'm like, yes, I'm eating. And then probably like as the food digests. I just get really tired and like I don't want to move and some, sometimes like my blood, my, my blood sugar kind of spikes so I get kind of like shaky and sometimes, not sometimes, but often I'll be looking at something, I'll look at it, but my eyes, my eyes can't focus on it. So like here's the thing I'm looking at and here are my eyes, my eyes should be like Hey, I'm looking at this. My eyes sometimes are like, oh, oh shit. Well, I'm trying to, I'm trying to look at something, but, but I can't. It just kind of, it's hard to focus your vision on things. Let's see what else. Everything tastes amazing, like fucking amazing. I'll give you a perfect example. Normally, everyone. All of us are like, celery is fucking trash, right? Celery is fucking gross. But when you're dieting really hard, celery is like, 
you get the stock of salad. And you're like, the gods have blessed me with such a wonderful treat. And it, it just tastes amazing. Like you crunch, you bite into it, and it crunches and you're like, oh, divine. And I, I know celery sucks, but right now it's amazing. I eat a lot of celery because it's barely any calories. And when I'm hungry, I snack on that or kale, something green that has negligible carbs. And uh, when I'm training, that's really hard when I'm training. I'll pretty much get dizzy. I'll essentially get dizzy after every set. And you're thinking, oh, you're not dehydrated. No, I'm, de I'm, I'm hydrated. I can't even talk. I'm definitely well hydrated. I'm, I always drink aminos during my, pre -work during my workout and water. So I don't just drink aminos, I'm drinking both. And literally after every set, I'm just like, I have to stop and just relax and not pass out. My strength has gone down a lot. To give you an example, there's a video on my Instagram where I'm deadlifting, was it 455? This was only like a month ago. I think I did 10 or 12 or like 9, something like that. It was a good range. And I deadlifted earlier this week and I only could only do 365 and I did 12. I could not go any higher. I definitely could not. Like that was the limit. That's a pretty big difference in strength. But, I mean, it's still pretty good, considering I'm on the verge of fucking passing out all the time. Ha! <laughs> you know, you need carbs and fat, you know, nutrients, stuff like that, for you to have normal brain function. And, you know, organ function. You're definitely a lot dumber when you're this lean. A good example, I'll give you a good example. The other day, everything's essentially like a haze. Just, I'm just like walking through like a mist and I'm just like, oh, oh, get this mist away. I don't really realize that things are there. Say I walk into a room and in the middle of the room there's a big bag, like a big bag, a big red bag, say that. Big red bag that you can clearly see it's big and it's red, like Clifford. It's there. I will walk into a room Literally like, mm, look around the room and won't notice the bag is how fucking dumb I am. Just cause I'm in this like weird, low, low cerebral function state. And all the time. Say I'll try to read a paragraph. I'll read it. You know, I mean this happens to you too. Uh, I'll read it and I'll be like, what the fuck did I just read? I'll read it again, I'll be like, what the fuck did I just read? I'll read it again, I'll be like, oh, what the fuck did I just read? That, that happens pretty consistently. There's been, there's been a few times where I've like kind of been on like the brink of passing out. Yesterday is a good example. I was doing an event with my shirts like I always do in the, the gym in a gym in Houston. And I started talking to this guy who I haven't talked to in a long time because I don't frequent that gym anymore. I started just talking. I already finished my workout. I'm gonna go get a protein shake. Just talking. I'm like, okay man, see ya. And I start walking away. And as I start walking away, everything just went And I'm like, oh. Oh, shit. I literally had to grab a pillar. You know, the gym has like support beams. I had to grab a pillar and just be like, everything's fine, guys. Just uh, keep, keep doing what you guys are doing. I'm just gonna relax here for a little. And I'm getting dizzy as I'm doing this. Uh, <laughs> uh, I feel like, maybe it's just me. I feel like my hair is thinning because of the diet. I feel like a month ago I had more hair than I do now. I know what you're thinking. Damn, this shirt looks amazing. I really want one. But you can't have one because I only made one and I'll have more later. I'll have this color soon enough. Just, just gotta wait a little bit till I get, you know, some cash money. So look, well, look at my social media. You can follow me on my fitness journey as I 
as I literally physically deteriorate in front of your eyes. In Instagram stories, you can see my health deteriorate in Instagram stories. Uh, hey look, diet plan. If you're like, hey, I'm really healthy. My life is going good. I need to stop that. I need to get really lean and try to die slow. I'll help you. Don't worry, I'm here to the rescue. Uh, the next video, I well the next talkie talkie video because the next one's a training video. I'll have the whole setup again. I know I said that last time, but this time for sure. So yeah, I'll be here next week. Uh, so just you know, share my shit with your friends and watch it 